So, let's go with problem number one for springs. And ito yung problem natin. A coiled spring with outside diameter, a coiled spring with 1 and 3 fourth inches outside diameter is required to work under load of 140 pounds. Wire diameter used is 0 0.192 inches. Spring is to have 7 active coils. And the ends are to be closed and ground. Closed and ground. Determine the safe shearing. <coughs> Excuse me. Determine the safe shearing stress and the unit deflection. Assume G equal 12 million PS. The mean radius is to be 0. Point 0 0.17 ah uh, 0 0.779 okay. Hindi ko makita wala akong tag dito. Salamin. So outside diameter given. Ilista mo natin mga given. PO 1.75 inch. A load niya is F 140 LB pound. Tapos ang wire diameter yung D that is 0 0.192 inches. Tapos, even naman dyan, yung mean radius dito. 0 0.779 inches. Meron pa ba? 7 active coils. N8. 7. Hmm, wala na. So, anong una natin isasolve? The shape shearing stress. So, let us first ilagay dito yung shearing stress. Okay, pag na-stress ka, that is 8 kfc na 8 kfc, bumili ko pa daw ng dalawang pi sa pi. So, wala tayong C. We have to solve first for C. That is Pm over D. Si K, wala din tayo. Lista na rin natin si wall factor, K. 4C minus 1 over 4C minus 4 plus 0.615 divided by C. Ngayon, ang una nating masasolve si C, pasok natin dito, and then si KW, pasok natin dito. Now, ang una nating isolve is C. C is 0 0.779, if I'm correct, 779. Pinigay dyan is mean diameter. divided by 0 0.19 Check na natin kung 0.779 divided by 0.19 That is Mapping ko muna siya Ah, min radius pala ang binigay. So, if that is min radius, alagay ba dyan? Yun, min radius. That is multiplied by E. Kasi ang DM is equal to 2 nung RM over D. Okay? Equal to times 2 na lang natin. This will be, pag muna tayo mag around up. So, 8.114 5, 8, 3, 3, 3, 3, 3. Okay, store natin tong value na to kay A. Okay. <clears throat> store natin yung value niya kay A. So, we will have to uh, substitute natin kay 4C minus 1 over 4C minus 4 plus 0 0.615 palitan natin si C ng A. Okay? So, 4, recall natin si A, minus 1, over 
4, recall A minus 4 plus 0 0.6 0 0.615 divided by recall natin sa ito. So, the value is 1.1812 Zero six seven five, and then we store this value into B. Okay, if in the store natin yung value kay B, so we will have now yung shearing stress. So the shearing stress SS is equal to eight kfc. So eight, the wall factor is one point one eight one two zero. 675 AF. The F is 140 LB pound. 8 AFC. C is 8.1145833332 pound. <coughs> Pi. What is the size ng wire diameter? 0 0.192. So, the answer will be pounds per square inch PSI, 8, recall A, times recall B, times 140, divide by 0 0.192 square times pi. <coughs> that is 92, 96, ah, 695. 9.2695.3263 PSI. So that is the shearing stress. Now for the deflection. Deflection, right? Eight fried chicken na good. And your formula. And then the deflection will be eight. Yung F140 LB. Tapos C. Ano ba yung C na nakuha natin? 8.1458 Tapos ang active coils natin is sinabi dyan, 7 active coils. Yes. Tama. So, 7 active coils. Divided by G, that is 12 times 10 to the 6 uh, pound per inch squared. Yes, I kasi. And then D, the wire diameter is 0.192 inches. Cancel natin yung isang inch. Okay? And then yung pound, yung pound, yung inch, yung inch na itirang isa. So, our answer will be 8. Recall natin si A. Recall A times 140 times 7. Divide both sides by, uh, divide all by 12 times 10 to the 6th power. Multiplied to 0.192. The answer would be Ah, hindi natin na-cube na to. Hindi nakalimutan. Cube natin. Eight FC. Okay. Cube. Okay. That is one point. And then deflection is total deflection is one point eight one Okay, that is problem number one. So that is problem number one.